okay so we are going to do i'm going to learn how to show password inside entry box so i'm going to start everything from scratch we are going to build a check box or check button and an entry box so first let's let's import a, so from tk from tinta let's import everything so next is let's assign okay so let's put it on okay so let's see what we got okay i think let's make it a little bit bigger so let's give it uh, giving it the geometry let's see 900 900 by 500 should be okay okay let's see what we got yeah i think it's big enough you can see whatever we are going to do so first we are going to create an entry box where we are going to enter our password so let's create an entry box sure an entry So let me pack it. So let me pack it. So let's make it a little bit wider. Okay, let's let it come down. So I think pad wide. So it should be a little bit in the middle. Pad wide. Okay, I think it's, it's in the middle, it's where it is, it's good, but it's too small, so let's make it a little bit bigger. So, iPad X, let's make it 100 as well, should be okay. And iPad Y, let's make it around 20. Yeah, I think it's big enough. We can see whatever we are going to do inside. So the next thing is to do is to create our check button. Let's create our check button. So let's assign. So let's place it. Let's place it under the entry box. So let's give it. Let's say X should be around. Let's say 200 should be okay. Let's say Y should be around. I think Y should be around. Let's say 79. I think now it's too small, so let's say 170. 170, let's check. I think it's a little it's far away. So let's increase the x value. So like to come to the right side. So let's make it 290. 290. Okay, I think where it is is enough. So let's add some text to the check button. So text. show password so let's see okay we had it so now let's type inside so you can see now as you are typing inside the entry box we are seeing whatever we are typing so let's click on the check button it's not doing anything and the inside the checkbox whatever whatever we are typing inside we're supposed not to see it so i think we can use the show command for this so inside the entry let's give it a show command so anytime what this is this what this means is that anytime you enter a value inside the 
entry box is going to show star that's what this actually means so let's let's verify and see so let's enter something so you can see now your password is it has been hide so your password your entry is not show so let's use the show button see you can see it's not affecting so when you click on the show button what is that is supposed to show whatever you've typed inside the show button so that's what you are going to do next so let's give let's give the checkbox a command as well command show password okay. can be any name at all can work so let's define the command so let's define show show password so what, what we are going to do now is we are going to well, we are going to give this a function we are going to use the if function such a way that whenever you click on the check button it's going to show whatever you are typing inside the entry box so that's what what we are doing now so we are going to use the if function so using the if function i want to use the entry so using the entry when you type inside the entry box entry okay let's see get and let's say show so i'm then show if this is so what this this means that this basically the same as the show function we did here it's telling us that if whatever you are entering inside the entry box is showing star that's what it means whatever you entry inside the show box is showing star then 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 so we are going to use the, the conf, configuration for that so the configure then show So what what this this is that whatever what this is going to do that whatever we are going to enter I think the code should come here first okay so whatever you are entering inside the entry box if it's equivalent to star if what you enter inside the uh, entry box is this then show this it means you are not show, you are showing nothing so it means it's going to show whatever you are entering inside the entry box so now let's say after you click on the checkbox it is showing you whatever you are entering inside the entry box now what if you want to unshow whatever you are typing inside again let's say you don't want to see whatever you are typing you want to take it back so that one let's use the s So the x over the s over for that so this this is config you are going to see the same config entry not config show sure. Okay, so what this this means is that with the if function, whatever you enter inside the entry box is going to show a star. So when you click on the checkbox, this command, I think there's something wrong with that command. I think there should be a comma first. It's done now so when you click on whatever your entry inside the entry box is going to show star so whenever you click on the checkbox it's going to show you 
whatever you are entering this is what this is about so what if you uncheck the check box again the check button you want to hide whatever you are doing then show back to star that's what the x does so this this side is going to change from it's going to change the values from star to the initial thing you are entering and the else is going to change them back to where they are previously so that's all about so let's see if it's working so now let's enter something so show as you can see you are seeing the password now so this is the first function so now with the s now with the s function if i uncheck it then it means it to show it to it to suppose to show the password again so anything I want to see my password if I don't want to see it so this is it thank you for watching don't forget to subscribe for our next video thank you